Yo, what it do, YouTube? It's your boy, Gento. I'm pretty hyped right now because we're getting into some 2K15 info. Now, on Twitter yesterday, NBA 2K, the Twitter account, they tweeted out this image of Trey Burke and all they said with the small little caption was, Trey Burke came to help out. That's all they said, but luckily, we have another image, and as you see from Trey Burke's Instagram, he confirms that he did a voiceover for 2K15. Now, I know you're thinking, okay, what does this have to do? Why is Gento telling us that Trey Burke just did a voiceover? Where's the significance in that? Well, if you played my career mode on the next gen on PS4 or Xbox One, you know for a fact that the only NBA player with a voice is LeBron James, the cover athlete. Now, no disrespect to any Trey Burke fans out there, I can guarantee that Trey Burke is not the cover athlete for 2K15. So, with that being said, since they're not just catering to the cover athletes, allowing the cover athletes to talk during cutscenes, I want to say it's a safe bet to assume that this year, instead of seeing your teammates just get frustrated with the subtitle text with their lips not moving, I think it's safe to say that this year in 2K15, there's going to be legit cutscenes where people talk. Now, it might not be from everybody. But I do like the direction 2K is going with this because it was kind of whack or kind of corny seeing that your teammates, they'll get so frustrated, but they're not saying anything. <laughs> they're screaming at you in all caps while you're talking. That just didn't seem authentic. But who knows, maybe Trey Burke might not have a cutscene in my career mode. Maybe they're using his voice for something else. Maybe they're gonna let you use Trey Burke's voice for your my player. Who knows, this screenshot right here just has so many possibilities. I wanna say it's a safe bet to assume it goes to my career mode, but who knows, he might have a spot in the training camp. Anything is possible. Obviously, it's still early, but it has been confirmed that his voice will be in 2K15. Now, in the comment section below, leave your thoughts. Let me know what you think. Do you think that cutscenes are going to improve? We've seen how cutscenes were in 2K14. They were not bad. Obviously, they could have been better, but who knows? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And as always, if you enjoyed this video and found this info useful, be sure to leave a like and subscribe if you're new. Thanks for watching.